Grandpa Bill, Grandpa Bill, story time with Grandpa Bill. It's Grandpa Bill's story time. Yay! Hi, I'm Grandpa Bill. Welcome to Grandpa Bill's story time. Come on in, make yourself comfortable, and we're going to sit down and read a good book. Okay, our book today is Captain Jack and the Pirates. Yay! By Peter Bentley and Helen Oxenbury. Oh, I think the boys are out on an adventure. <laughs> Let's see what it's like. Mm-hmm. An adventure. Jack and the Pirates. Trying to get to the pages. Okay, here we go. Jack, Zack, and Casper, Brave Mariners 3, were building a galleon down by the sea. A galleon is like a ship. <laughs> He's bearing his little bear. Up rose the sides and the stern and the bow. Zack, the ship's boatswain, worked hard on the, br on the prow. <laughs> See, we're saying they're building a little ship. Doesn't that look like fun? Oh, look at the little fishermen over there fishing. A stick for the main mast and one for the yard. Trying the two sticks together was tying the two sticks together was hard. Just tying the sticks together. A shirt and a bib, an inflatable ring. For cannons, three buckets were just the right thing. See to make like look like cannons. <laughs> They're making a little ship, like a pirate ship. And there stood the galleon, fit for the fray, as brave Captain Jack ordered, Anchors away! <laughs> Look at the shirt they're using for a sail. <laughs> That's cute. They hoisted the mainsail, the flag was unfurled, and Jack and his pirates said, Off round the world, through oceans unknown, many miles from the land, sailed swashbuckling Jack and his buccaneer band. <laughs> they're using their imagination, right? Like they're pirates out in the ocean. Ahoy, men, cried Jack with a quirkle of pleasure. An enemy pirate ship laden with treasure. Steer a course after them, good boats and Zack. And Zack answered brightly, aye, aye, Captain Jack. <laughs> you see the ship in the distance. Uh-oh. <laughs> so cute. Look at the teddy bear. <laughs> Casper, take care of the cannons, Jack said. Look sharp in the crow's nest, Captain Boy Ted. As they closed in, every man did his duty. Hungry for glory and enemy booty. <laughs> They're attacking the ship. <laughs> oh, no. Arrgh! Oh, look at the pirates. Oh, they look mean. Don't they? Look at the pirates. Oh. Oh, no. Their proud pirate flag fluttered high in the breeze, and the ship sailed into stormier seas. The wind became stronger. Hold on to the sail, cried Jack as they battled the tropical gale. Down came the rain as a hurricane roared. Down came the sail, and then... Uh-oh, they're in a big storm. What's going on? Look at the teddy bears holding on for life. Man overboard! The sides of the galleon started to slip. Quick, cried the captain. Abandon the ship! <laughs> a big wave must have come in and, and took away half their ship. Oh, no. <laughs> Look at the little boy. <laughs> and the rain's coming. Jack and his shipmates all struggled ashore. We're marooned on an island, he cried. Let's explore. Those enemy pirates were shipwrecked here too. Let's hunt for their treasure, said Jack and his crew. Casper, stay here while we see what we find, said Jack, just in case we're attacked from behind. <laughs> They're exploring. Captain and boats spied out the view. And then a loud voice cried, Jack, is that you? The enemy pirates hissed Jack to his mates. We must rescue Casper before it's too late. 
<laughs> the seagulls. <laughs> they ran down the hill and Jack cried, Oh, ho! brave little Casper, he's seen off the foe. And look, here's their hideout. Jack hollered with joy. The pirates have fled, lads, and... Oop, go ahead into the little shed there. Here they are. <laughs> Treasure ahoy! Jack and his shipmates all gasped in delight as they hungrily stared at a glorious sight. Right, let's divide up our booty, said Jack. Caught you, a voice cried. The pirates were back. Uh-oh. They were found food. <laughs> they found food. There was no point in struggling. Their hopes were all wrecked. Jack sighed. Now we'll all walk the plank, I expect. Oh, their mommy and daddy came home. But those pirates were friendly. They stared out their treasure and added three ice creams. Aww. <laughs> As their mom and dad came home <laughs> with ice creams, too. Just for good measure. Oh, they all get an ice cream cone. <laughs> Look good, right? <laughs> They were having fun using their imagination, pretending they were pirates. Aww. Oh, there they are walking back home. Mommy, Daddy, and the three kids are walking back home. Aww. <laughs> what a nice book. Thank you for sharing this book with me today. Come back again for more stories with Grandpa Bill. Goodbye.